New tonight in Pueblo, a growing list of ballot questions for voters there for a tax increase. One of them, a request for money to build a new jail. Another asking to increase the sales tax for marijuana. The questions approved by county commissioners today and Bill Folsom in our Pueblo studio looking into what voters will face on election day. The jail and marijuana questions are now part of a half dozen other tax questions. With that many, it can be a tough sell to voters. Pueblo voters will decide if the sales tax on marijuana goes up from 3.5% to 6%. This puts our sales tax much more in line with the rest of what's happening in, in the state of Colorado. And marijuana business owners tell Pueblo County Commissioners there is support. The biggest and most critical capital improvement need uh, for the county is a jail. The marijuana tax could bring some revenue for a new jail in Pueblo County. The sheriff and county commissioners prefer a dedicated funding source. They've approved another ballot measure asking for a 0.39% sales tax to pay for a new jail. And I've said many times that I don't want a new jail, but it's needed. It's something that has got to happen uh, for a merit of reasons. Commissioners voice concern that the jail question could suffer because of all the other tax questions on the ballot. A request to extend the mill levy for libraries. Both school districts, 60 and 70, asking voters for money. And Pueblo West Fire asking voters for dedicated funding. As you can imagine, my focus will be uh, pretty heavily weighted on these two county ballot issues uh, as they pertain to the jail and uh, bringing marijuana taxes to a more appropriate level. There was no criticism of other tax questions, just statements of making marijuana tax changes and funding for the jail priority.